you guys doing today? Well, I wanted to let you know that this is a product that I have been wanting to try. So what these are are reusable freezer bags because I have been going to the Dollar Twenty Five store and have been buying those freezer um, bags. But I go through so many of those and I needed to find something that was more cost effective for me since I'm doing all this meal prepping and cooking in bulk and buying from the big box stores. And you know, sometimes you buy in bulk, you need to break this stuff up and put it in individual bags. So when it's time to eat these particular foods that you need to divide them. So this is something that I wanted to try. And I am just telling you guys, I love it, love it, love it. And as you can see, I have stored pancakes in this one. And it has the resealable top where it is just like, like a Ziploc. But look at it. This is a seal on it, just like a Ziploc. But it's, um, it's made of this durable plastic. And you just close it. By just pressing it down and it is all sealed up ready to go and I have made a bunch of pancakes and I have put them in the freezer and they have done fabulous and in this one I made some of those egg muffins where it's just eggs um, that I beat it up and put it in a muffin tin and I just added things like bell peppers onions you know, you can put meat in there, you can put cheese, whatever you want. It's like an omelet in a uh, little cupcake pan. So I was so excited about that. But then one of my YouTube um, buddies um, and their channel name is l, l Honeycomb Homestead. Miss Lovey told me that when she was in Walmart, she stumbled upon these. Now this, I just purchased these the other day, and these are reusable freezer bags. So I said, hmm, let me try them. I'm gonna do a comparison between this one that I purchased off of Amazon, and I think they came in a pack of four, and they were like 12 to $14, I do believe. And these, they have a package of I do believe this is four. Yeah, it's a four pack. And they were five dollars. And the capacity is 76 full ounces. So, and I love it because it is for freezers. So, and that was my main purpose. I wanted to find something that I could put in the freezer. And this was just inside the bag to entice you to, you know, purchase them. But this is, gives you an example of what you could put in the bags. If you're doing like vegetables from your garden, which I'm also going to be using these bags for, is another reason why I wanted to start trying to switch over to these type of bags. And they come in four different colors. You got the red, purple, green, and this beautiful teal color. So I am going to see how well they do because it's, now I noticed that this the plastic part or the vinyl part is not as thick as this one because this one is like heavy duty, but this one is like um, thin. So we're gonna see because as you can notice that this one was twelve to fourteen dollars and this one was just five dollars. So, um, but we're gonna give it a try. It has the same kind of seal as the other bag is and you can see the what i'm talking about how thin it is and i wanted to let you guys know that your girl renee from renee's garden is going to be your taste person um taste tester not taste tester um i'm gonna be testing this product and letting you guys know what i think of each one of them for this one i'm loving it because it's thicker and it has um um, I could pull these things, um, like these pancakes out of here, and I can just um, put them in the microwave for a minute or so, and they come out beautifully, just as if I had just taken them out of my pan from just making them. And same thing for these egg muffins. 
beautiful. Love it, love it, love it. So I'm hoping that these bags will give me the same results as the other bag. And if that's the case, I will be switching over to these bags because they're a little bit cheaper and um, I can buy more of them. This one is something for the long run, which I am looking to do because I want to make sure that when I start pulling all that stuff out of my garden, that I will have the proper um, tools and bags or, you know, things to keep my food well preserved. Because you don't want to go out there and do all that work in your garden. And then you come in and put them in these bags and then they get freezer burned or, you know, they don't taste right or um, the consistency is much different than you want. So, child, let me be the product tester and I will get back to you guys and let you guys know what I think of each one of these bags. Now, this one is pretty good. The only thing about it is the price. Like I said, about $12 to $14 on Amazon. But my mother always says you got to pay for the good stuff. But now if you can find another brand that can give you half the quality of the first one, I'm going to give it a try. Because like I said, I can buy more in volume and that's what I'm all about. All right, guys, I just wanted to bring you this video to let you know what product that I will be testing and letting and getting back to you. So this again is the one, the name brand that I got from Walmart. Thank you, lovey, for letting me know that Walmart has these bags um, for $5. Well, they're $4.97, so you might as just say $5. And these ones I discovered on Amazon. Don't those pancakes look delicious? I had those for breakfast this morning, and it was fabulous. And it's so much easier for you to just go out there and pull out the serving you want and don't have to pull out all the pans and you got to make it. I am loving it. All right, guys, I will get back to you when I have made something to stick in this bag and let it freeze and then I'll take it out and test it and see what my thoughts are. All right, guys, have a wonderful day. Have a blessed day and look out for the update on these freezer reusable bags. All right, guys, take care. I'll let you enjoy looking at my pancakes. Mmm, so good.